Hello, I'm back with Cheeky Jumbo Plate 9, and this one is called Wild at Heart, and the theme of this place is, plate is animals. So there's all kinds of different animals on here doing all kinds of cute little fun things. So uh, starting up here in the corner, um, here we have a little cow, and we have a pig who's having, or, or is, yeah, a pig having tea time, a little monkey with an ice cream cone, um, a little elephant. Oh, and this is a good um, point for me to mention. This sort of, um, the stuff here, this is left from the, uh, the, the backing, the blue backing that the plate has when it comes. It's just adhesive and it comes right off with a swipe of acetone very easy and it definitely doesn't interfere with the stamping. So if you get one of these plates and you take off the blue backing and you see that and you're concerned about it, that's all you have to do to take care of it. Uh, next up is a little flamingo. Um, great for all of those kind of Miami manicures if you're going to go on a trip to Miami. Little giraffe head and then um, cute kitty and it looks like in a kind of a college sweater or something like that. Um, uh, there's a very different kind of butterfly. Very cute with the little face and everything in it. And then a monkey playing baseball and a little ballerina kitten. Um, this one is, I think, a froggy, and a froggy that's got a ball that he's playing ball with. A little bunny, maybe that bunny is having maybe some tea up here with this pig that's having the tea. Um, a little froggy face. Cute kitty with um, maracas. How fun is that? Um, another cute little kitty. And then we've got lots of cute little kitties. Uh, a little sheep. I love that sheep. That's so cute, and that would be great for anything like um, uh, baby shower manicures or anything like that. Cute little monkey face. Um, looks like maybe a teddy bear. Maybe this one over here was, nope, that's a cat. A little teddy bear. And then we got a little pig face and a little kitty face. And I like this little panda guy. He's dancing. He's fun. And then we have a fish. And a hippopotamus face, which uh, I think I've mentioned before, I have a friend who loves hippopotamuses, so. Um, little seahorse, a little panda face. And I love this little puppy face with the little spot on the one side, so cute. Um, and then a chicken. Now, it's hard to make a chicken cute, let's face it, or at least I think it's hard to make a chicken cute, and that's a cute chicken. And I like his little jaunty hat there. Um, pretty butter, uh, dragonflies. I love dragonflies. They're kind of my thing and, um, or one of my things at least. And that's a nice overall image. Um, little chicks. I like that. I think that's cute. And ladybugs. Easy little ladybug design. Um, you know, I don't know if it's just because this is like an animal plate, but when I see that, it makes me think of like amoeba. I, it is so weird. Suddenly I see little like one cell germ organisms on a plate from when I was in high school. Um, little feet, which would also be great for, um, uh, you know, of course, baby shower manicures, anything like that. I love this. This is one of my favorite images in the whole collection. Cute little cat curled up. And then uh, spotted print for any kind of animal print or anything else you want to do. This reminds me of Barrel of Monkeys, playing Barrel of Monkeys, trying to get them all to link up. So, so fun. I just, I don't, I don't know why that game always intrigued me, but I could play it for hours. Um, more fish, different kinds of fish, which is, is definitely, I like having a range of things. So you can get different kinds that you like. Dolphins. And kind of a, a zebra stripe sort of print, an animal print. And then this one's got your seahorses and your other fish and some sea turtles. Um, little kind of cheetah leopard deal going there. Different kind of ladybug. Um, and there's my little friend, my little panda friend that I love. There he is again. And then some monkey faces for you. Kitties and puppies. And then panda faces and a different leopard cheetah kind of thing. And that little fancy elephant. Um, pig face overall and in a different direction of animal print so I mean I like this you can do a lot of fun different things with the different kind of animal prints if you want to do all in the same manny um, this reminds me kind of like of bamboo or you know, just random brush strokes I love it and there's that cute sheep again horses and then leopard in with stripes and a little kitty or puppy or any kind of animal prints I guess and um, kind of a, a cow print and um, 
my dog has uh, spots kind of like that. So you can do it for a dog, you can do it for a lot of things. Um, little swirls, and I like that kind of shattered look. Oh, not the shattered hearts though. Although I have to admit, I'm known for doing the anti-Valentine's Day manicure. Just because, not because I don't like love, not because I'm not romantic, but just because I think Valentine's Day puts a lot of pressure on people that, you know, people don't necessarily need. So they need a voice and, and a manicure out there to say, hey, if you're not totally into Valentine's Day, that's too cool too. So you could do all that kind of stuff with that. Um, birds like seagulls, oh, snails. I really like that. I think, you know, there's lots of snail images out there, but I, I think that one's really nice. I like it. I think it's well done. Um, some pretty butterflies and some cute little bees with little smiles on their face. So again, this is Wild at Heart and it is Cheeky Jumbo Plate 9 and I will go do a test of it for you and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back with the stamping test for Jumbo Plate 9. Let's take a look at what I stamped here. I, of course, I had to do my, the crazy drunken panda, dancing, crazy dancing drunken panda. He's so cute. Um, and then I did the little chicks, because I love that image. Great lines, no issues. And I did the snails, because I just think they're so cool, and because it shows you the, those big areas they're not blotchy, they come out really well. And then last but not least, my cute little sheep. So sweet. All right, in terms of um, size, again, just like the other plates, if you already have a cheeky, um, one of the cheeky jumbo plates that's, that are from the Alphabet series, these are the same size. And in terms of Conad, these are a little bit wider, as you can see, and a little bit taller, maybe. A little bit taller, a little bit wider. Um, a little bit, so you have a little bit more to play with. Um, and if you want more information about the dimensions and things, there is a comparison post on my blog that you can look at. So there you go, Jumbo Plate 9 stamps well. Great images. Um, definitely recommended. Thank you for watching. Bye.